In this demo, I'm going to show you how easy it is to process invoices with EasyBills. First thing you need to do is create a trial account. So click on the Try EasyBills for Free button. Then type in a username, email, password, phone number, location, and choose to integrate with QuickBooks Online. And we are ready to get started. Now, before you can go any further, you will also need to connect to QuickBooks by clicking the Connect button and signing into your QuickBooks account. The first thing I'm going to demonstrate is how you can drag and drop an invoice and it will automatically get uploaded into QuickBooks. It has immediately started processing and in a few seconds it will be in QuickBooks. So you can see the invoice has been exported to QuickBooks and if you hover your mouse over the document tile you can see information about the invoice. If you want to see the original invoice, simply click on View Document. Also, if you click this link, it will open it in QuickBooks and you will be able to have a look. As you can see in QuickBooks, we export the invoice on a line by line with the tax set as well. Another way to upload invoices to QuickBooks is via email. So you can send an email to this address here. We can process invoices as email attachments, part of the email body, or as a hyperlink. Once again, you can see it has been uploaded to QuickBooks. Now, if you go into settings, you will notice that duplicate checking has not been enabled. Otherwise, there would have been an error message saying that it wasn't exported to QuickBooks because it's a duplicate. Another thing I would like to demonstrate is email approval. So I'm just going to enable this in settings. I will also enable duplicate checking this time and save these changes. So now I'm going to re-upload the invoice. Now it's going to process it like before, except it will first be sent to the default email prior to being exported to QuickBooks so it can be approved. As you can see, it says that it is waiting for approval. Until it is approved, the invoice will just sit here. So if I go back to the email account, you can see that the email has appeared now. If you click on this link, it will open up the invoice. You can see that there's also an image of the invoice here and the summary invoice data. If you are happy with that, you can click Approve. If you don't want it to be approved, you can click Reject. I'm just going to approve it. And as you can see, the invoice has been approved. So what will happen now is it will automatically be exported to QuickBooks. However, this time, I have duplicate checking enabled. So what I can expect to happen is this. It says, Duplicate detected deleted. So the invoice was not exported into QuickBooks. By default we process documents as bills but we can also process sale invoices, spend money transactions, supplier statements, purchase orders and employee expense claims. You can find out more about this on our website. Thank you very much for watching.